Hey, I'm a zombie, and I'm just standing here because I have nothing better to do than stand here and look you into your soul with my empty eyes, even though I technically don't look at you. Hello everyone and welcome to Plants vs Zombies. They are continuing the fog levels and we're going to level 6, the Miney Boy. Okay, let's ready ourselves up. Now for this guy, I only need a split B. Okay, let's do this. Let's first start by planting your sunshrooms. Maybe too much in the fuck, but okay. We only have so many flags, but okay. Plant that one there as well to help. Plant you there. And plant you there. Plant you there. Okay, zombie came again that long. Plant that one there. Plant that there. And plant that there. And you there. Plant him there. Plant this guy there. Now that's a corn head. And then there. Help him pop show me. It's time to use you. Seriously. My sunshine start to grow. Which is good. Thank you there. And this guy there. Oh, the miner zombie, the miner. Oh, great. There goes that sunshroom. Now plant that guy there. Okay, I put down the puff room where it needs. Time to put more of these guys. Well, we are pretty okay -ish, but we all need the emergency doom shroom, and I don't have the snuff sun. I still don't have the sun. Please. And there's that guy down there that I need to take care of. Fast, please. Mm. 
and we got the star fruit. Shoot stars in five direction, which is nice. He will actually be useful against these guys and to for multiple zombies actually. Oh, looks like we are unlocking the pumpkin as well. Finally, no need for the tall nuts. Oh, and there comes the crazy dude. Okay, let's start this and oh, the fog is now even further in the lawn. Well, this ain't good. This ain't good at all. Thank you there. The problem is where he is. Oh. Oh no. And then it goes one puff shroom. I'm gonna plant them more in front. And let's not forget about the sea shrooms. Oh great, two flags as well, just notice that. Well, this is gonna be so much fun, isn't it? Yeah, give me that, give me that, give me that. Okay, our sun first Shroom's army is done. I'm trying to bring these guys to the table. First of all, I'm protecting the sun light. We don't want to lose that. Surprisingly, no bigger zombies, yes, no minor zombies. But I'll start planning the star fruits. Oh, but there is a crazy zombie. He almost, I don't think he was far from actually exploding. More puff shrooms and sea shrooms and coming spamming out the lance with them. Oh by the way you don't do that. Ah great, there comes another crazy dude. The problem with that guy is that he's also faster than your casual zombie. 
model. Okay, that's one of the problems. The other problem is that he literally explodes. There he goes, that's Trom. And we're done. The star for the army is done. Now we are ready. Oh, I don't have what I need for the emergency boom room. Never mind. Everyone out. And we got the pumpkin. Which is gonna be a replacement for the walnuts that actually don't cover more of the link text plants that are within its shell. We are hitting for the next one and oh, I thought this guy wasn't only on the roof level. There he is, jumping and jumping. The problem with that guy that is that he's jumping over the plants, so I just got the pumpkin, but I will already need instead a walnut to block him from jumping over my plants. Which is straight up annoying. And if before I get probably before I get to even plant the walnuts, this guy will get to jump over my plants. Let's do this. I like that. Let's plant it. Well, there's a zombie up there. There's a zombie on our lawn up there. And just realized I don't have any light source, which is definitely not gonna be good. And that was so dumb placement. And that's some dumb placement number two. Here and fire where the fire up there. Get this guy out. Mm. Where is he? That's the problem. Oh damn it. Please die. Please die. And he this is exactly why I brought the tall nut. Uh, 
Oh, damn it. The guy can't jump over the tall lamp because it's so big. Which gives us the advantage. You know, he remains with a disadvantage. Boom. Everybody exploded. We got the magnet room, which will take care of this guy with his pogot stick. Blind fate and complete an extremely foggy level without using plant room or blower. Didn't even intend to go for this. And we got also the magnet room, removes helmets and other metal objects from zombies. Get into level 9. Oh, there he comes the jumpy punchy zombie and the balloon zombie freak. Three, two. Okay, I think this is less foggy than the last one, which says something. Okay, it's also two waves, so I'll need to plant a lot of fume shrooms. Good thing there is no zombie that goes and there's no minor zombie because you will have been a pain to deal with. with especially during two flags because I remember in when I was in Survivor 2 that guy was spammed everywhere. Give me that, give me that. Give me that. Give me, give me. Find that there. Now we can see for a while. Right in here now the pool with the fume shrooms. I need them especially up front because they have short range. In the sense that they don't reach too far.
You know what, let's put another line of sun shrooms just to have as much production as possible. Because I think I'm going to spam a lot. A lot. And there goes that guy's um, metal helmet. So I'll put that there. In one team especially protected. You know what I mean? It takes some time before they can uh, do their power again. Perfect timing, what can I say? I need another one of them. You'd come there. They actually got to them. Yep, he lost his bogus stick as well. Now there's a lot of sun coming down, which is neat. Because we need a lot of sun. Actually, we pretty much uh, are a Soon, don't all of that uh, juicy sun. I didn't mean to plant you there. I need to grow on this. Nope. Can you get out of there? <laughs> I didn't even meant to press the menu. We got a letter. And let's see. Hello, this is your mother. Please come over to my house for meatloafs. Leave your front door open and your lawn unguarded. It's certainly mouth. Definitely not zombies. Yeah. They definitely didn't have a spy for this job. Okay, let's do this level 10. Oh yeah, it's this level. Why it gets so dark all of a sudden? This can't be good. Ah well, hope you survive the night. Oh god, that's gonna be chaotic. I don't even... It's... Uh, it's... Uh, it'll be interesting if they use the It's a Raining Seed concept on this one. Anyway, see you after I beat this. BDSD of a level.
Okay, this le okay, we finally beat up the level and let's see what we got. The cabbage boat. That patch boat. Hurl scalp patches at zombies. Continue. And now we unlocked the roof level and looks like we can accelerate the adventure too. Anyway, hope you all liked this episode. And see you next time.